hello guys it's your girl aisha narixa welcome welcome back to my channel if you're new here thank you so much for stopping by if you've been here thank you so so much for coming back and guys so today i decided to do this look as you can see the inspo was this hood this hood of mine so i decided to put in like some green some jungle green touch and yeah so continue watching and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed and also share if you like this video make sure you watch it till the end and if you like it give it a thumbs up so guys as you can see i went on and did my eyebrows off camera so for today's eye look i'm going to be using the james charles palette so i'll be going in with this shade and this one yeah I think those ones alone from this palette and maybe that shade and if you're, if you're hearing like some sounds outside kindly ignore it because there's a building under construction around the uh, where i live so for a start i'm going to go in with the, the green shade first it's going to act as my scholard transition shade so I'll just apply it here on top as you can see if you see me looking this side I'm just looking at my mirror and after that I'll go in again with another brush and now we are going to go in with that black shade So the black shade, I'm just applying it at the inner crease, as in that here, this area. So I'm just evenly supplying it. So after that, I'm now going to go again with our green shade and apply here at the top. And yeah, we are done with with that. I'll now get my micellar makeup remover plus this cotton earbud. So what I'll do, I just do like this. Yeah, and I've gotten them enough amount that I need. So I'm going to remove that eyeshadow that is in the cut crease where I want to apply another shade. cut crease i'll be going in with um illegal pro concealer in the shade phone so let's cut that crease Sometimes cutting that crease can be hectic, sometimes just as easy as it can be. So today... <laughs> so for my crease... I'll be going in with this um, palette, Glam Beauty by Nazi. And I think I'll be using um, this shade. Yeah, that one. Yeah, and this one. So for the inner crease, I think I'll just tap, tap, don't drag. I'm going to go and cut my my eyeliner. I'm going to go in again with this brush. 
to like trace the area where I'm going to cut it. and remove this excess shade that is here yeah like that and before I forget I have to apply this shade that will do uh, I've taken another brush it looks like this As you can see I'm not going to go in with that shade it was more glitter so before that what you're going to do I'm just going to spray it and now apply the shade And yeah, that's how I wanted it to look like. You see? So let me go and do the other eye. I'll be right back. I'm done with the other look. So for my primer, I'm going to be using this e.l.f. primer. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to put a small amount. This is enough for me. And I'm now going to like evenly apply it on my this so you can rub or you can tap however you feel like me it depends with the day like there are some days i can do like this there are some days i just like rub it so for my face i'm going to be using this fit me in the shade 55 355 so I now get my damp to blender. And now I'm going to just tap it in. You see? Just tapping, I'm not dragging. As I always say, never forget behind your ears, in your neck. You don't want to be having two shades. So I'm only applying it on the areas that I want to highlight. So now I'm going to go in with this sharp side, sharp ending, and I'm going to just tap it in. Don't drag. If you drag your product, it's going to be having like patches, and we don't want that. So that I can tell you. Or advise you it's just tap 
so like this don't mm -mm. we're not doing that just tap it in setting powder i'll be going in with this w7 banana drinks setting powder i'm i'm applying my setting powder on the areas i had applied my concealer i don't know if i should i try to be and see like sometimes i always apply i'll show you guys so sometimes i always apply like my setting powder here on my, around my jawline you see here but that's my jawline <laughs> okay but it always backfires for me for my case i don't know why but let me see if i can try it. now let's brush it I've let it set for too long. I don't always let my setting powder set for long. I use this W7 compact powder. I'll be going in with this fluffy brush. It's just brush. This one you're allowed to brush. I contour palette. It's from Nika. Nika contour duo it looks like this I'll go in with this dark shade So after that, I always go back in with the brush that I used to apply my compact powder. Today, my, my nose has refused to be snatched. Why? Why? Why are you doing this to me? I think I've applied like the wrong shade. No, 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 no. So for my setting, pre plus prime mark. It smells so nice. Using this from 
from illegal actually it's broken i always say that i'll buy it but i keep on buying in my head i keep on buying but i'll make sure i buy this month god willing so this is what i'm going to be using the bridge of my nose so I don't always like apply like one straight line like this no apply like a dot over here then another one here like this and after that I can use my finger to evenly supply it like on top and this one I'm just going to dab it if I see it's not like enough I can add so i decided just to put my my thumb yeah uh this one and this it's more of like two in one so i decided like to put like it's called what the part like eh, just open it right now seriously <laughs> so i decided just to put this and what i'm going to do next i'm not going to put like any lipstick i'm going to apply this lip gloss let me go and apply my lash my lashes off camera i'll be right back so guys we are done done so this is how it looks like you can see anyway thank you thank you thank you so much for watching if you like this video kindly give it a thumbs up if you want me to do like more tutorials more makeup looks kindly comment and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed share like and give it a thumbs up so anyway thank you so much for watching